What is going on guys, this Waffle here, and welcome back to some more Stardew Valley. Now, last time we left off, we actually did a few things, quite a lot of things actually, including going to the movies finally. We got seven radiant ore right there, which I think is enough for it. Do we have enough for two more uh, ingots or just, okay, just one. So we have eight total now, but went to the movies and saw a movie called like The Brave Little Sapling or something like that with Penny and she really liked it. So that's awesome. Speaking of such, let's see what she's up to. I have to go into town today. Don't work too hard and eat something good for lunch. Oh yeah, last episode we went on a bit of a scavenger hunt. Like we gave Kent like that like war photo of a soldier or something like that. And then he gave us like tomato salt and we gave the tomato, like gourmet tomato salt. We gave it to uh, Gus and he gave us this rose over here, Stardew Valley Rose, a rose that reminds you of the valley. It smells heavenly. So I kind of want to go give that to either Evelyn or Caroline. And if it's neither of those, I guess we'll just keep giving it to random people and seeing if anyone likes it. Like I wonder if anyone can like reject that. Or is it like the first person I give it to, even if they like it or dislike it, they'll, they'll still take it. I don't know. But either way, we have more uh, worm stuff over there as well as uh, hard to. Oh, I thought those were rice, rice uh, shoots or whatever. Yeah, rice shoots. Yeah, last episode, we got like, what, three taro roots finally for the very first time. So now we're actually getting some seeds from them. And I guess this episode we can go uh, replant them right back down. But there you go. Grab those. And let's put the cheese back over here. Actually, you know what? Yeah, keep that cheese at least right now. We're going to make as many pepper poppers as possible, although I don't think we're going to need pepper poppers for much longer because right now I believe uh, there they are right there. I can make eight of them. Golly. Oh, yeah, because I have a radio. Yeah. Hold on. Let me put up the iridium ones just so I don't accidentally use them. Right there. You go. put them in that chest. <laughs> Let's see. Uh, pepper popper. There you go. So now I can only make four. OK, cool. Uh, then I have two in my inventory. Let's put the extra ones up in here like so. But yeah, this episode, I do want to go check up on the coffee because that should be done now. If we go outside, the coffee beans should be done. And we're going to get a lot of those. We can start making coffee again finally. So, oh, yeah. And then we have a mail right here for the egg festival tomorrow. Dear Waffle, tomorrow we're holding the egg festival in Town Square. You should arrive between 9 a.m. and 2 p.m. if you'd like to attend. You wouldn't want to miss the animal egg hunt, Mayor Lewis. All right, cool. So if I go down here, yeah. So last episode, we also moved the uh, the oil maker things down here as well, just so they're a little bit more convenient for the truffles. So that's good. Uh, whenever we get them from the pigs and whatnot, whenever it's not raining, of course. Oh, wow. Our luck. Wow. Our luck is 12, 12 percent. Yeah. 12.5. Man, I think we're going to go back to the skull cavern, you guys. And then, yeah, we, we still have to get like leaks and stuff with like that. And then, yeah, 100 tar taro roots or whatever right there, too. Yeah, there's a lot I need to do, you guys. Golly, but for right now, let's just get pepper poppers so I could. Uh, there you go. I don't know if this actually affects whenever I'm harvesting or if it only does it whenever I'm uh, planting them down or what. But yeah, so we have a lot of coffee over here done. It's going to be done two days. So I think not every other day, but every two days, I guess you could script every other other day. <laughs> that's when we're going to get the coffee over here. So that's pretty cool. And then in one batch, one 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 harvest. We got 112 coffee beans. Those are just, oh yeah, that's all of them combined right there, which is pretty good because you need five of them to get one coffee. We specifically left open a few uh, kegs over here just so we could make coffee. So now that we have that done, start making some coffee right here. The ones that are mainly by the door. Boom. Awesome. Look at all this. It only takes, what, 30 minutes? Oh, wait, no, two hours. I thought it was 30 minutes, but no. Uh, we have a lot of them going right now, which is amazing. We need three coffee to get one triple shot espresso. Those should be done by the time we actually go to, and then we and then we have 21 coffee beans left over. Of course we do. But that should be done by the time we actually go to the Skull Cavern uh, later this episode. I definitely want to leave before, like, say, noon or something like that, so we have as much time as possible over there, and we, more, you know, more likelihood of actually getting, I doubt we can go down to level 100. I'm like, I feel like, I feel like we need to leave it like the middle of the night for that to actually happen. And by the way, someone did comment last episode saying I forgot to put down the uh, scarecrow. So you know what? I was thinking, uh, well, after I read that comment, I might as well just put the uh, scarecrow down like that. Then I could just remove them and then uh, grab the, the jazz or whatever over there. So that should be pretty easy. But for right now, well, let me just take care of some of the busy work over here and hopefully I can get. Wow, look at that sturgeon came out of the water right there. That's kind of crazy. But uh, let me just take care of some of the busy work around the, the farm and stuff. And hopefully we could leave to go to the skull cavern before like, say, noon or something like that. That'd be really good you guys so uh, let me just get all of this oh yeah and then start a valley rose I, I guess on the way there can go talk to evelyn or whoever where is she at she's just home okay she's home so that, that's fine and then on the way there or on the way back to the bus stop and go to caroline and all them yeah oh yeah and then before we leave because i know i'm going to heck and forget about it let's go make some more farm totems because i always heck and forget about them right let's get one in our inventory there you go and then in the future we can make another one if we need to 
magnet. We can get three magnets. It's kind of crazy there, but yeah, let me continue doing all this busy work over here and I'll see you guys here in just a bit. All right, guys, I'm back. It's noon right now. Uh, let's just go around town real quick. I, and of course, it's Friday, so I can buy another iridium sprinkler. Let's go over here. Let's let's check if Evelyn wants to like trade that rose and give me another random item to give to another random person. Evelyn. Boom. That's a very pretty rose, dear. Have you shown it to Emily? It makes me think of her. Really, Emily? Why Emily? Isn't she the she's the one that likes the the, the crystals or the gems or something like that, right? So Evelyn just straight up told me who I need to give it to. So let's just go to Emily if she's I hope she's at least she's by the sewer, so or you know, she should be. Is she here? Oh she is. Okay, cool. Emily. Oh, that's beautiful. I have a friend who would love that. But she lives far from here. Oh, you know what? You know what? Emily and the Sandy. We've seen Sandy's birthday. Emily was over in the desert. This is perfect because we're going over there anyways. Okay, cool. So uh, let's just go to the sewer real quick because we're right here anyways. Uh, go buy the $10,000 Iridium Sprinkler and go put that by the Junimo hut because uh, the other Iridium Sprinkler, we use that in the, uh, in the, what do you call it? Oh, don't accidentally give it to him, by the way. Golly. Uh, da da da. Yeah, he doesn't talk on Fridays. I think you guys said some weird reason, but uh, monster fireplace, sign of the vessel. I don't know if these are in the uh, furniture catalog, but there you go. We got the Iridium sprinkler, so now we could use that in the uh, Junimo hut area. So we could actually have as much ground covered as possible over there. But uh, let's just go which way? I guess up here would be faster to go back to the bus stop rather than going all the way over there and ride the minecart and all that kind of jazz. But it's 1 p.m. And I know the uh, the traveling merchant, she, I'm like, we don't need the batteries anymore, like that badly, honestly. I buy a ticket for Kaliku Desert. Um, 110. Do I want to go buy more bombs? Yes, let's buy more bombs. Just because we used a few of them last time. Let's go buy a few of them just real quick. And by the way, I made five more triple shot espressos. Uh, I didn't drink any in real life. I know it sounds like I did, but uh, I didn't. So, <laughs> oh, I forgot to read what he said right there, man. Let's buy another 25 mega bombs and maybe another like 50 regular bombs. I don't know. Like I still, we're still over 300k even with buying all those. Golly. Yeah, that should be fine. That should be fine. And I think we have luck food in the Skull Cavern, so let's just ride this to the bus stop. It's going to be 1.30 by the time we actually leave. So, yes, buy this. Uh, jeez, get out of the way, Pam. <laughs> I don't know if I want to... Maybe I'll leave. Uh, yeah, because she closed her shop at like 1.50 uh, p.m., right? So we need to visit her right now if we want to. And by the way, worms up there. Two, two spots of worms. Don't want to forget about that. I know there's cactus right there, but we're literally... Oh, man, it reminds me. I forgot to... Uh, Part of the cactus this morning. Got mud. Let's see if Sandy's going to like this this rose. Desert rose. Boom. A Stardew Valley rose. That's so lovely. Thank you. Whenever I miss the valley, I'll smell this rose. <laughs> Here, take this. It's been on the shelf for 10 years and no one has bought it. You can have it, though. Cool. So we got an advanced TV remote. Ooh. So who would like a, an, an advanced a TV a remote? I don't know, but I'm just going to put that up in the chest for safekeeping so we don't accidentally lose it if I, like, die in this gold cavern, right? But there you go. Mud and more stuff there. And I think we have stairs here, too. I think I left stairs here. I don't I don't bring any, but we can craft more in my inventory. I've got 366 uh, stone right here. Master slingshot. Yeah, we got 12. And then, yeah, I'm glad I bought more of them. We only had 10 mech bombs and 52 regular bombs. Yeah, I guess I'll keep the 25 and the 50 I have right there. But uh, luck food. Spicy eel, pumpkin soup. Yeah, let's get the pumpkin soup. I don't know if the pumpkin soup lasts. I, I think the pumpkin soup doesn't last quite as long, but it gives you two luck instead of just one, but I think the spicy eel might last longer. Wish the mod actually told you how long it lasted, but I'll grab that and I'll put up a bunch of random stuff I don't want to lose up inside of there like so, so. All right, I think I'm good. Let's get the pumpkin soup going. Real quick, it's 2, man, 2, 10 p.m. And boom, pumpkin soup. And I'm good to go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. And immediately right off the bat, uh, we don't have any speed. Whoops. Uh, I guess we'll lay down a Mega Bomb right there, boop. And let's get ourselves a Triple Shot Espresso going. What in the world's going on with that anime? Oh, I got damaged just a little bit. Man. Oh, wow. We found a hole right off the bat. Ba-boom. Jumping in. Forget about that dragon. All the way down to level five. Not bad. All right. Well, so far, so good. But uh, some of these rocks are very sparse. Sparsely placed. I guess you could describe them as they're not very close to each other. Wow. Oh, man. Another hole. Man, that was lucky. Let's break this. And boom, we got a lot of stone right there. It's falling this another hole. And might want to heal up here pretty soon with that arm. Another four uh, levels right there. Awesome. Oh, whoa, whoa, we got a dragon around the bat. Hold on, hold on. Boom, this is a perfect room for a mega bomb. Boom. He got, oh my gosh, he got sliced and exploded right there. That was crazy good, but there you go. Let's take this ladder right here. Let's take that one. All right, cool. Although they, they lead to the same area. I don't know why I'm like, oh man, that ladder takes me to a different area. 
and let's try and kill this guy if I can. Mega bomb time, and boom, slice him, and he got exploded, and another whole oh, man. Awesome. Okay, let's fall down. The actually, you know what? Yeah, omelet time. Thank you. Oh no, eight levels. Oh, I was trying to eat the omelet right there, but golly. Let's see, how much of that health did that do? Eh, a little bit of health, not bad, not bad, but thankfully I still have the crystal fruit right there, so let's go to heal us up to full-ish, right? And let's kill this guy here. Let's lay down another Mega Bomb. Let's get away from that. Whoop! Oh my gosh, look at all that gold over there. Holy heck, I'm gonna have to heal up here in just a sec, but there you go, cool. And we got a bomb from that one, <laughs> that was crazy. Okay, we found the way down right there. Not not a hole or anything like that, but I'll still take it. Not bad, not bad. Let's, let's use some regular bombs here too. There's another, there's a regular bomb there. Oh man, found the way, okay, cool. I was about to lay down another one, cool. Okay, let's keep going, keep going, keep going. Ah, let's do a regular bomb here. There's a ghost over there though, I see. I wanna get another. Uh, oh, no, 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 we're, we're good. Let's get a, there you go. Oh, wow, found a way to, man ladder. We're already on level 21. Ba-boom, level 21. <laughs> My favorite level, of course. Uh, but now I'm going to be trapped here, so I uh, might want to watch out. Uh, took a little bit of damage right there and found the way down and a bunch of stone and iron and whatever else over here. Not bad. And we got uh, whatever that is right there in Amethyst, but if we just go to the end of this, we could find the uh, uh, guaranteed ladder, so let's just do that roll. Oh, barely missed that guy. Nice. And we got coal, too. Yeah, we definitely need that. We just bought a bunch of coal. We got six coal right there. Cool. So, uh, eh, decently sized room right here. I don't know if I want to use a bomb just yet. Oh, here we go. This is going to be a good spot to put a bomb. Actually, you know what? Let's do a mega bomb right here. Boom, in the middle of all that. And a dinosaur over there. Nice. Staircase. No hole, though, unfortunately. Let's just go down the staircase. And I know there's like two jades I missed out on right there, but it's not that big of a deal. Let's place down a bomb. Oh, wait, isn't that? That's the purple rock. Yeah, we got a jade from it. Yeah, you guys said the purple rock. I think the purple rock is the one that gives you like a random mineral if you break it. Yeah, cool. And there's just a, I think that's a staircase just out in the open on its own. Cool. Uh, but anyways, we've got another dragon guy chasing after me. I need to watch out. Make sure I don't get heck and killed. Ah, oh, man, where am I going to place these bombs? Place down a bomb right there. Awesome. Cool. Do another bomb right there. And other explosion. Okay, cool. Uh, anything else around here? Any, any more bombs or... Thankfully, it's not a level that, like, requires me. Oh, man, that's diamonds right there. That's diamonds. Hold on. Eat pepper poppers. Eat, eat, eat. I don't have, like, anything else to heal me up except for a life elixir. I don't want to waste it on that, you know? And boom. Oh, no, they gave me the diamond. They didn't give me the diamond. Oh, my gosh. I might need to use a bomb. Why am I not placing the bomb? Oh, my gosh. Life elixir time. Jeez, I'm getting hit like crazy over here. Boom. And, oh, man. Okay, we got the diamond. We got the diamond. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Oh, is that a hole or is that... I can't tell... There we go, killed that guy. And yes, it's a shadow. <laughs> Man, I'm freaking out over here. I think it's a heckin' life elixir. There we go. Okay, found our way down. Immediately have a heckin' thing in the way. <laughs> Man, iridium. Awesome. Explode that. And yeah, we don't have to worry about like the bomb exploding the iridium and losing it. Cool. Anything else around here? And more iridium, because we are in the iridium layers. Yeah, level 26. Not bad. I think our best was like level 50 or 60 or something like that, right? Let's do a bomb right here in this tight space. Noise. Another one right here, I'd say. That's a good spot. Wow, look at all that. Let's do a mega bomb right here. Boom, in the middle of all that. And what was that? Wood? Oh, there's a hole right there, too. Okay, cool. Anything over here? Got uh, Omni Geos and stuff. Anything over here, though? Still have a uh, double speed. Oh, yeah, because we've got the uh, Pepper Popper just a minute ago. Cool. Wait, what is that? Is that the. Uh, is it, yeah, that's, that's one of those, like, monsters, but I, I must have exploded the rock off of his back or something like <laughs> that. Well, let's just go fall down that hole, though. It's 6.30. Let's go fall down the hole. Forget about the dragon. We still have good health. Took a little bit of damage right there. Seven seven levels? That's pretty heckin' good. Not bad. And let's just lay down these heckin' bombs like crazy. Just because we have so many of them, might as well use them, right? There you go. There's another bomb there. Another bomb there. Another one over here. We got a jade. Boom. And I am not seeing anything. And boom! Kill that guy. Or at least hit him. Turn around and hit him immediately. Knock this down. Got ourselves a magma geo right there. Okay, well, I got a staircase. I know there's Omni Geo. Oh, I know there's Omni Geos over there, but I'm getting that guy out of there real quick. Golly. Let's do a uh, Mega Bomb in the middle of all this. And whoop, turn around and hit this guy. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Spam, spam, spam. I'm low on health. I'm low on health. Let's get another uh, life elixir. Yeah, I need to get more regular, like, healing stuff. But uh, at least we did a good job there. Surviving and whatnot, right? Any more radium around here? No, it doesn't seem like it. We got a ghost. Okay, this is another uh, Mega Bomb room. So let's do that right there. Perfect spot, I'd say. And did some good damage. Not bad. Okay. Got a lot of stone and Omni Geos and whatever else. And we got uh, Staircase down. Okay, cool. And we're now to level 37. Not bad. But I'm honestly, not that good either. But 730, you know? I feel like I'd be a little bit deeper than this. 
No holes, no ladders. Iridium, though. Okay, you know what, you know what? Man, I hate these dumb dragons. Wish there was a way- Oh man, I forget to put on the vampire, uh, ring or whatever that thing was called. Man, gotta do that. We got another heckin' dragon right here. At least I'm like full health-ish. Yeah, there you go, cool. He's down. Got one of these weird guys. I don't know what in the world that guy's all about. <laughs> and we got another man! Ah, this like, fog event or whatever right here is spawning in so many dragons, I just know it. Whoop! Turn around, kill him. Hopefully they explode. Okay, good. They got explode. Took a little bit of damage, but man, there's just an unlimited amount. Okay, you know what? Uh, should I grab that? I'm like, I'm literally spawning in Iridium back home, but... Oh my gosh, another life elixir. Jeez, there's just unlimited dragons around here. Let's just go. Let's just go. Oh, whoa! Got another thing. Four quality sprinklers. I'll take it. I'll take it. We're using those in the bottom part of our uh, farm area. That's honestly not bad. I can't complain about that one bit. But uh, for right now, just explode these over here, I suppose. <laughs> Whoops, there you go. Even though... Uh, there's literally a ladder right there, but I'll still explain. Hey, look at that. We got a ruby, though. I'll go down. Let's go down. Anything good here? No, it's just another one of these layers right here, but... Our luck today is really good. We got down to level 39. Maybe maybe we'll make it to level 50 if I'm lucky. A little bit of coal right here, though. That's pretty good. Let's break these up here. Hopefully get something out of these. Gold and nothing. Okay. Let's see. What's this? Man. Okay, let's do a uh, regular bomb right there. We got a... Not a radium bat. Okay. Yeah, let's just go down. Just go down. Just go down. Lip. Okay, cool. Iridium over here, though. That's great. I like to see that. Do an explosion right there. An explosion down here. Awesome. Get that iridium. Another explosion there. Noise. And we got the way down. Okay, anything down here real quick, by the way? Not really. Okay, let's just go down. Ladder. Level 42. That's double 21. <laughs> Man, these dumb dragons. I I, I need to see what, when we, like, kill the amount that we need to for the Adventures Guild. Because I've killed so many of these dumb things. There you go. Another one down. Awesome. And we got a nice spot to put a bomb over here, so let's do that. Boom. And just regular quartz there. Anything up here? Oh, nice ladder. Okay, let's go down. Let's go down. Cave carrots right there. Yeah. Hey, cave carrots are decent, but... Oh my gosh, okay. Uh, hold on, let's do a bomb right here. Bomb! There you go. Bomb right there. We got a purple mushroom too, by the way. Don't forget about that. And... Get the mummy. Let's go down. Did I get the purple mushroom? We did kill it. I it shouldn't have killed it, but... Oh, we got a, uh, a slime-infested layer right here. Huh. Look at this. I have to kill all the enemies in here, so I don't know. I don't, I don't know if that's a waste. Eh, it might have been, honestly. Oh, it actually broke the ground, and gave me some cave curse, though, so that's not too bad, I suppose. But I'm kind of stuck here until I kill all the slimes, the big ones, break them into smaller ones, and then kill the smaller ones. Wow, at least I'm getting some iridium right there, though. They're iridium slimes, technically, I guess. Two iridium right there. Not bad, but not good either. For how much damage I'm taking and whatnot. This is when I'm right next to him like that, but I'm trying to pin him up against a wall. We got another big one. Oh, yeah, and a small one there, too. I need to watch out. Need to watch out. The one on the bottom is about to jump, and he got... I, I, I think I'm not taking any damage from him. That's good, that's good. This is the last one. There might be one all the way over there to the right, though. Come on! Kill him! Jeez, okay, found the way down. Cool. And we got another perfect spot for a Mega Bomb here in the middle. Cool! And let's see, what do we get? And a little ladder, and a bunch of stone, and... Oh, whoa, we got a hole, we got a hole. 1050. And let's jump in. Our health is... That should be fine. Okay, yeah, we're orange right now. And we're down here. Anything good? Uh, not really, but I'll explode a Mega Bomb right there. Just get the radius of it. I do know there's already a spot down there, but uh, let's get a Pepper Popper. Just, just whatever. Uh, heal up a little bit. There you go. Heal up and get a little bit of speed, too. Cool. And I think I can take another. Oh my gosh, immediately a heckin' dragon, giving me no time to get a heckin' triple shot espresso. And boom. Oh my gosh, I'm already down on health. Let's check our inventory for cave carrots. There you go, six of those. I'll have to spam those just real quick. Oh, radium right there is a great, great level. 53. This is pretty good. Let's keep eating until we're like green. That's kind of like a yellow green. Let's wait until we're like solid green, like that energy bar. And that's pro. Yeah, that's good. That's good. That's good. Okay, let's do a uh, thing right there. And we'll do another one over here. Okay, those are the iridium bats I need to watch out for. And I think I. No, no, it just knocked him back. Man! Golly. At least we explode with this over here and get some iridium, do another bomb. Because we have so heckin' many of them, right? And what in the. There we go. Golly. Man, I'm taking way too much damage over here. Okay, we got a ladder over there. That's good. I got some coal and stuff over there too, but I'm eating these cave carrots. Man, I'm just trying to pay attention to. Oh, we got amethyst right there too. Trying to make sure I don't get killed too. And we get to Aqu Aquamarine or something like that right there. 1140. Might want to leave here really soon. Oh wow, I got two already more. We got a little bit of solar essence and a blobby gloob around there too. And that's another purple rock that's going to give us a gem, I believe, right? And we got two Aquamarine. Okay, cool. One of them from. Oh my gosh, get the heck out of here. Get the heck out of here. Go! Man, don't block the entrance. 
<laughs> literally blocking at the- Oh my gosh! I hate these dumb dragon things, they slow you down so much. And, man, I need to get a better weapon too, I don't know if I'll get that, that galaxy hammer again. Do that right there, do another one right here. Why am I not placing them down, golly, there you go, golly! And we got the Iridium Awesome, and we got an Earth Crystal, it's 1220. Let's do a uh, bomb there, another bomb here. Awesome, maybe another bomb right there, just real quick. Anything over here, Iridium, okay, we got a staircase, cool. Don't know if there's a hole up above me, but... No. Okay, cool, cool, cool. I could zoom out and that'd make that a lot easier, but- Oh my gosh, once again! Get the heck out! Jeez! We're gonna get killed by one of those things! I think I have gotten killed by them before, but... There you go, anything good? Anything good? Okay, let's just leave, let's just leave. We're too low of health. 1250, it's gonna give us a little bit of time to get home to. Golly! Alright, well let, let me get some of our stuff back and reorganize my inventory and stuff. Oh yeah, I didn't get any staircase. I forgot to grab the staircases on my way down there too, yeah. And the, ener and the energy atonic. Yeah, I needed to grab those too. That's basically a life elixir. It's better than a life elixir. We got to basically five more iridium bars worth of ore right there. Might be able to make a sixth one depending on how many I have left over at home. But yeah, we still got a pretty good amount of stuff uh, in the end there. Not bad. Let's just head home. See if there's any worms here I might have missed. All right, I guess I'll grab the cactus fruit on the way back. <laughs> there you go. Anything over here? Or worms? Oh, that's just another cactus fruit right there. I'll grab it. Let's just go home, and then we'll probably think. I'm like, we have the egg festival. I don't know. I don't know who would like that. Hold on. Let's let's read let's read the description of it. See if it gives us any hints for the TV remote. There you go. We're wrapping back home. At, was it one? Not 140. 120. Yeah, that's a lot of time. Yeah, nuke. Let me get you on you. Any leaks? No, no leaks for George. Unfortunately, we already gave him one last episode. We still need to like pick them or grow them or whatever. I forget what, what's the specifics of what we to do. Like, oh, I have to place them. Yeah, I don't even know where this first one is, by the way. I just straight up. Oh, yeah, I turn it into seeds or something like that, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, let's get more, uh, two truffles, put them over here, and then sell these overnight. There you go. 50 golly. So those overnight, hopefully I can. There you go. And I, I guess sell the daffodils. Like, what else am I going to do with those, right? And I think we're good to go. Okay. I, I could smelt the iridium, but I don't know if we have the time. We have 26 iridium right there. Where's the iridium at? Where is it? Ah, oh, it's right here. It's right here. Smelt it. Ah, go, 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 go in the house. Oh, emergency bed. Oh. Okay, at least we didn't get any penalty except for emer er, energy penalty, right? So. That's good. <laughs> Man, day t uh, 12 of spring. I don't think it was anyone's birthday. I think, what's her name? Haley. I think her birthday is after the egg festival. So next episode, right? Day 13 of spring. Ooh, it's a spooky day. Ooh, spooky number. <laughs> oh yeah, and then iridium right here. On top of the iridium that I have in my inventory. And yeah, I forgot to water these uh, in the morning. So yeah, it kind of sucks, but uh, there we go. Cool. They all got watered and we have literal stuff. Man, another seven right there. Amazing. Awesome. And five bait too, golly, that's great. And uh, put that up in there like that, cool. I'm going to smelt all the iron and whatnot too, but uh, how much, yeah, we have 76 copper. What, what was it that I wanted copper, was it for? Yeah, so I can make three more furnaces right now. I think we have, do we have eight right now or 10? I don't know. I think we have 10, yeah. I was about to say, maybe I can get two more. Yeah, you know, let's just get two more anyways, there you go. I need to figure out like a more permanent spot to put them because I don't know if I'm going to keep them there because I do want to widen that pathway to be too wide now. And, I haven't done that yet, so I definitely want to do that here sometime soon. Let's put up uh, some stuff like that. We have eight quality sprinklers there. Uh, that, that's good to have. And then, of course, the original. We need to go do. We need to go place that down here in just a minute too. And that goes there, and that goes there. Oh yeah, we can put the uh, bone front. We can put. The, I don't know how many was it. Five bones for each uh, bone mill, something like that, right? Yeah, we have a uh, three more iridium bars I can smell right now. You guys got leave one, two, three. Let's get those going. And uh, is there anything else we might want to smell? Iron, we, we have so much gold and stuff, I don't think it's that big of a deal. I'll just leave that there and then definitely want to do something with the iridium bar. You know what, let's go to Clint's. Let's upgrade, if I wanted to upgrade something right now, what would be the best? Because everything right now is gold, so I could upgrade anything to iridium. Would it be the pickaxe, would it be the axe? I'm like, the pickaxe, maybe? The axe, not really that big of a deal because we're literally bombing tree, but we're also bombing rocks and stuff too, so, hmm. Yeah, you know what, let's just do the pickaxe. That probably makes sense, and I don't believe we're able to upgrade the copper pan. I think we are, yeah. I, I already said something like, oh man. And if I'm going to Clint, I might as well, uh, and then we'll get five, what is it, 25,000? Yeah, we could afford that, right? Overnight. Uh, but let's just go outside. I don't know if any of the cheese is done, but man, the iridium's still not done. It's going to be done here pretty soon, though, golly. But there you go, cool. And we have some more uh, oil done down there, too. And our animals hopefully haven't escaped. 
Woo. Okay, they're all down there. That's good, because I left the heckin' gate open overnight. <laughs> but there we go. Pet all the animals. Let me take care of all the animals, getting their uh, cheese and, and, and mayonnaise and all that kind of jazz set up here. And truffles. Yeah, we just got another truffle right there, too. Cool. Oh my gosh, you guys. I don't know if you guys can see it right now, but a lot of wine up there finished up. And you know what? I, I know I've been getting comments saying to do this for a while to like kind of line up everything to where they all finish at the same time. I think I'm going to do that. I think I'm going to wait till all these other kegs. Yeah, 11 hours. I just have to wait one more day. 12 and eh, a little bit more in a day right there, but just so everything finishes at once instead of, you know, small chunk here, small chunk there, you know, uh, and then I always have to come back all the time at least. And of course, that makes the keg on the outside actually make more sense. So it will indicate when the ones on the inside are going to be done, right? But uh, oh, those aren't done. The ones down here are done. Yeah. But yeah, man, we're going to get so much money overnight, you guys. It's going to be insane. As well as even some of the preserving jars over there are done, too. Yeah, cool. I may do the same thing with them, too. Although I don't know if everything over there, like, processes at the same rate. Like, Spook Fisher. I don't know if, like, these different rows take longer than other ones. I don't know. I might I might just do the same thing over there anyways. 23 days. Or 23 hours. 3 hours. 15 hour. One day, one night. Yeah, I might, I might just wait for them, too. Yeah. Just kind of line them up a little bit. But, of course, the coffee finishes so fast, it doesn't matter. So, I'm going to put these up in there. Like, oh, oh, and the egg festival just started. Golly. Yeah, I don't think we're able to go to Clint's today, are we? Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. The, uh, Lava Eel wants something. Three fire cords. Do we have that? I don't know. And let me check up on this. I don't, I don't I think I missed the greenhouse yesterday. Whoops. Uh, I don't really have the inventory space for them, unfortunately. Oh, yeah, I need to lay down those furnaces. I forgot about that, but uh, let's actually see. Yeah, we only have four right there. Okay, cool. So we actually can place these over here. So, yeah, uh, two of them are smelting right now. So I guess I'll just temporarily place these like this. Boom. 25,000 from the, the eight star fruit wine. 27,000 from the 12 ancient fruit wine. Golly, that's amazing. And of course, just sell all that to get some insane money overnight. Oh, whoa, what do we get in the mail right there? Hold on, what's this? Uh, Pierre, wait, oh, the cashback rewards thing from Pierre's again. Okay, yeah, wait, how often does that happen? Seems like we're getting it way more often now. I don't really know what's going on with that, but I'm not complaining. Man, I should have bought more starfruit while I was in the desert. I forgot about that. Yeah, our starfruit finished up. I just harvested them right there. Man, well, let's go see if we have any lava or uh, fire quartz for the lava eels. I believe we have until 2 p.m. or something like that for the uh, for the event. So, oh, yeah, we have tons. I think it's three that they wanted. So let's do that. So we get more uh, room and they can, you know, multiply over there, if you will. So that's going to be great. Uh, then, of course, when those iridium down there are done smelting, we'll actually move that to be three or uh, two, two wide or whatever. Oh, wow. He just jumps out of the water. Hey, look, it's fire quartz. Just what we wanted. What are you talking about? We it's just one of you. <laughs> but anyways, uh, let me just. Take care of some other busy work real quick. Putting the cheese in the cellar and all the kind of jazz. Oh, yeah. Let's go place the uh, iridium sprinkler in here, too, by the way. So that would go where? Here we go. Uh, oh, I can't, uh, can't really place it perfectly here, unfortunately. Man. Uh, see, I need to place it, like, in the middle to get the full coverage there. Uh, I don't know. Uh, let's just go to the egg festival before it ends. I think we have until 2 p.m. and it's 1 right now, so let's just go right now, and then, and then yeah, I can sell that overnight, too. We're going to make a lot of money overnight, golly. But let's just go over here, see if any, uh, what are they called, leaks? Oh, no, that's dandelion, I think. Man. Okay, whew, I was about to say, was it too late right there? But thankfully not. <laughs> Anyways, what do you have to do, uh, what do you, what do you have to sell? Oh, yeah, strawberries, yeah, because you're only able to get strawberry seeds during this, yeah. You know what, should we... Place those in the greenhouse, or at least a few of them. Only a hundred for each, like pack of seeds or whatever. Let's get, I'd say, twenty-five. That's always a good number, at least to start out with. And then seasonal plant, plush bunny, lawn flamingo, colorful set. Ooh, all the, like like everything like this, and even the seasonal plant. Like we don't need those anymore. Because and then decorative pitchfork. <laughs> like I have a decorative axe, so I wouldn't be surprised if uh, I have a decorative pitchfork in the. Uh, furniture catalog as well, but yeah, don't think there's anything else there I really, really want. Our hens have been working overtime to prepare for the festival. Ooh, they deserve the best tonight. Bowls full of sweet yellow corn. <laughs> That's right. And I'm going to find all their eggs here in just a bit, too. Uh, hold on. <laughs> I can't line my face up with this, this little pink bunny over here. Hold on. What if I do this and then get out? Man, it's always going to be off center, but I know it's Harvey. What do you have to say? Eggs definitely have a place in the well-balanced diet. You're absolutely right there, Harvey. What, did they help you out with, like, cholesterol or something like that? Oops, I should take off my doctor's hat for the time being. I think I said that last year, too. Like, everyone says the same thing, and therefore it's making me say the same thing, too. Uh, Jody. Vincent loves the festival, and it's a joy to see him so happy. Actually, you know what? I don't know. Should I continue talking to Because it seems like everyone... This will be the third year in a row. I don't know if anyone says anything different. Maybe I'll just cut all this footage out of the like festival episodes from now on let me know in the comments down below what you guys think i should do about that 
Do you think everyone's ready for the egg? Yeah, you know what? Let's do it. I think I can still talk to everyone uh, after the event is over, I believe. But well, let's just start the event right now. The sooner we start the event, the sooner I can win, right? <laughs> Me and my egg and dinosaur costume there, golly. It's time for the highlight of today's festivities. The annual spring egg hunt. Woo! Calm down now, kiddos. You're going to need all your energy if you hope to find the most eggs and take home the exclusive prize. So is the prize going to be different from last year? Or am I going to get a second straw hat now? I don't know. Hopefully it's different, though. Because, like, golly, you know I'm going to win. That's just going to make it even worse when I don't win because I keep on talking about it. Now, is everyone ready? I am. What about the kids? They're over there jumping for joy and whatnot. Let the egg hunt begin! All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Where are the eggs? Where are the eggs? There's one over there. Hold on, there's one behind the the Boom, we got one. And we got two. Any more? Oh, one over there. Hold on, can I? Oh, I think I can get it. I think I can get it. Boom, we got another one right there. Oh, man, there was an egg over there. I didn't I didn't see it, man. There's one over here by the graveyard. And over there by the tree, too. Let's go grab that one. Go grab that one before Jazz does. And no! Man, I ran into a tree. I get stuck. Oh, here we go, here we go. Yeah, the graveyard always has a few of them. There you go. Oh, don't read the gravestone. Oh, there's an egg. There's an egg. There's an egg. I don't know if they could be hiding. Surely they could be hiding behind the trees, right? It just makes them that much harder to find. There's 17 seconds left. I have nine eggs. There's no. Oh, man. There's an egg in the tray or uh, the bed of uh, Mayor Luz's truck. Uh, there's one behind his egg. Oh, man. Stop. There you go. There you go. And then one behind his house, too. I don't know how to get back there. There you go. Five seconds. Five seconds. I've got 11 eggs. Any more? Egg? Oh, there's one under his truck. Is that an egg or is that a flower? I guess that was a flower. Man. All right, well, 11 eggs, that's still pretty good. I don't know how many got last year. I need to go look at the footage, but hopefully I still won. <laughs> wow, look at all these eggs. Yeah, you're welcome there, Mayor Lewis. Ah. Now, if only I can get you kids to pick up litter this efficiently, then we'd have the cleanest town this side of the Gem Sea. <laughs> you said that joke last year, Mayor Lewis, and the year before. Golly. <laughs> and now, the winner of this year's egg hunt is... Waffle. Hey, yeah, hey, look at that, I was right. <laughs> Waffle wins, awesome. So am I going to get another straw hat or what, what, what do we get again? A th okay, a th okay, I guess if you win, you get a prize and if you win again, you just get money. So uh, sorry about that kids. I'm just too good at this. <laughs> Ruining the kids experience two years in a row. Hogging all the fame and fortune from winning the egg hunt. Looks like there's some cauliflower I missed out on earlier as well. So let's go take care of that. Go harvest them. Of course, no giant cauliflower because we don't have anywhere they could grow. There's no three by three area over here. And I was kind of like, that, that was kind of a thing I was okay with. I, I was okay with just being like, you know what? For sake of like putting a bunch of stuff around the Juyama hut, I, I'm just going to do away with getting like a giant cauliflower, giant pumpkin, giant melon, all the kind of jazz, right? Two days until we get the rhubarb again. Golly, but we have more, uh, yeah, we have more garlic seeds right there. So let's grab those, put them down here. And then, uh, I guess, 1120. Well, these are already fertilized with something. I don't know what they are. I need to check the uh, built-in wicket to tell me, but uh, everywhere else, like, if I plant, if I replant anywhere else, I need to put fertilizer on. Quality fertilizer, speed grow, something, just to make it that much more worth it, but, uh, I don't know if there's anything else I really need to get done. We might go to bed relatively early again, <laughs> especially over, oh, yeah, the, oh, I forgot to look at the, uh, it has more buttons than a regular remote, perfect for the Avid TV watcher. That would be George. He's always, re he's always watching TV. So let's just, well, we'd have to do that next episode, though. Man. And then we get, okay, yeah. strawberry seed. Let's go put those up over there. And then, yeah, I, other than putting up the seeds and whatnot, I can't think of anything else. Uh, and then, of course, the truffle, whatever over there. Oh, yeah, should I, should I plant those? I don't know. Strawberry seed. It probably makes sense to put that by the Junima. Oh, yeah, it's 11.50 right now. I probably need multiple Iridium sprinklers for the Junima hut. To like fully cover it, you know, like one on the top and then one on the bottom, and then that might cover it. Either that or, yeah, I, I might need to go to the actual farmhouse and grab the smaller quality sprinklers and place those down, a few of those down, right? That might be what I need to do. But if I do that, I might I might put the strawberry seeds over there, but it only does it in spring. Yeah, only in spring. So we have two weeks of that versus putting them in here where we can get multiple weeks of strawberries, right? So I think I'm going to do it. Let's do it. Multiple weeks, weeks of strawberries. Pretty good uh, little, little little fruit there, right? I don't know if I'll place them down here. I'll place one, two, three, four, five. I have five. That's 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 fine. That's that that's that's good enough. Then uh, the rest of strawberry. I don't know. I'll keep them in there and maybe plant the other ones over by the Junimo hut, perhaps. Like maybe I'll keep five up in here. 
There you go. Keep five in there. And then uh, do I have fertilizer? I might as well grab fertilizer. So, yeah, let's get the deluxe bee grow just because the, the strawberries are they only have two weeks. Might as well get as much as we can out of them. Right. So let's get the deluxe bee grow. Let's go back to the actual farmhouse. See if we can get more deluxe bee grow from the coral and whatever else we have over there as well as the what are they called? Quality sprinklers. Let's grab those too. So, yeah, we have those. Eight, there are eight of those bad bellies. And we'll grab the we'll craft. More quality for us. Yeah, the Lexby Row. So, we can get. Uh, how many? We have 15 right there. So, yeah, just boom. There we go. 16. Uh, quality. Or the Lexby Row. Golly, I can never remember. <laughs> 1230 right now, though. I think we have enough time. I need to place down some of those uh, lamp braziers. I need to place down some of those uh, around the actual farm here. But. Uh, yeah, I can place one there, and then place one there. Yeah, look at that, right there. There's another one there. And then do the same thing here. Yeah. Yeah, right there. And then another one right here. Yeah, boom. Okay, so, so we have full coverage here now. Awesome. So let's uh, do this. Do full tillification. Oh, and then I need to water them too. Man. Well, uh, place the strawberries like this. So, strawberry. Oh, that's where the uh, sprinkler is. Whoops. There you go. And then I'll leave... There you go. I think you're able to walk through this. I don't think it's like impenetrable or whatever you'd call it. But uh, we can we can lose a like look, look at all the heckin' stuff we had overnight, you guys. We we can lose a thousand gold if it means uh, getting the strawberries watered. So uh, oh no 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 150 150. No what the why am I going up man? Golly it went from like 140 to 2 a.m. like instantly there man. Penny go what the <laughs> I'm outside and then Penny's inside giving birth. You're kidding me. I'm such a terrible father just straight off the bat. Man. Okay, well, that's awesome. So we got a baby girl. Awesome. What should we name? Oh, my gosh. We're going to give her a what? <laughs> Grotchers is the first heckin' name. I'm going to remind. I'm going to remember that. Fatigue? Gungus? G Gungus? <laughs> Why would I name anyone Gungus? Hold on. Let me. Can I copy and paste that? Let me write that down over here. Gungus. There you go, in case it, I can't come up with anything else. Snef, Sani, Gruka, Zombie. I'm like, isn't there like a Z like theme that we had earlier on? Brongus? I don't know if I'll do that though. I'm probably going to end up doing a Gungus for her name. Oh um, yeah, we're getting some repeat names, I think. Bramers, Surtert, Surtert, Bro Broke. Wow, I hope she grows up to be very wealthy so she could be named Broke, but she's like a millionaire. Like you like her dad over here with 300k. Maybe she'll be an actual millionaire, unlike myself, because I'm always hacking spending stuff. But let's just name her Gungus. Gung what in the world? Oh, I have caps lock. Gungus. There you go. Gungus. Big Gungus over here. <laughs> 67,000 gold overnight, and I'm losing a thousand gold. And I'm gaining a daughter, too. So day 14 of spring. Sorry, Haley. Sorry, my daughter gets more attention on her birthday than yours. Uh, yeah, Haley's birthday, but it's also Gungus's birthday. It's a literal birth because she got birth today, right? Penny, what do you have to say about being a mom now? Everything went well, and now little Gungus is a part of the family. We're very fortunate. Okay, can I change her name, by the way? Like, that's such a wacky, goofy name. Gungus, I don't know if I get Because you can't name, you can't rename Zongus over here. You can't rename Nuke, at least as I'm aware of, unless there's like a console command I put in. Maybe you could do it that way, but yeah. I, hold on, where is she? Is she up here? Oh, she is. She's in the crypt. Oh, Gungus is sleeping. Oh, look at little Gungus up there with the green blankie. Oh, so cute with the little, little, little genie mode cover. She's going to look up and see her dad as a literal dinosaur. <laughs> Oh my gosh, so cute though. So, uh, what does the built-in wiki tell me about going? Oh, is it not? It's not telling me anything. Oh, jeez. There we go. Born spring fourteen and year three. Newborn thirteen day. Okay, so two weeks until be sh uh, she becomes a an actual baby, and then probably a toddler, and then I don't know if they can continue to progress into like child and then teenager and then adult. I doubt it. But there you go, you guys. Little baby Gungus over here. <laughs> Man, if we get another, hold on. How many, how many babies can we have? Because we have one crib, but we have three beds. I don't even remember getting three beds. I remember having two beds. Or did I actually, I think I accidentally bought a baby. Oh, wait, no. What are, that's the same bed. Yeah, I don't know what that's all about. And then Penny's going to come up here and tend to her daughter, or what's she doing? She's going to bed. Oh, wait, no. What in the world is she doing? <laughs> I don't know what Penny's doing over here, but uh, 
Anyways, let's get, let's check up on this and I'll do the outro stuff. Two already, more. Yeah, it makes makes sense. We got like seven, eight, and seven the past few days, right? So it makes sense to kind of balance it out by only giving us two right there. See if anything's actually happening outside though. Traveling merchant again uh, today, so I guess that's going to be cool. What do we get in the mail though? We got the oh yeah, build a thousand gold from Doctor Harvey. Uh, I'm used to it. And then Evelyn gave us a random piece of bread. <laughs> awesome. And then uh, down here we got some more uh, oil, truffle oil, and probably more truffles down there. And I need to get the three uh, fruit from there. But look, oh, the Junimos are harvesting the, uh, what is that? Uh, rhubarb. Cool. Awesome. Well, oh, I forgot that. Yeah, I, well, at least these over here I can give the quality fertilizer. But man, I probably shouldn't have even planted them last night. Because now they're going to be like uneven. Some of them are going to be fertilized, some of them are not. Uh, cause you can't, you can't do these. Oh wait, no I can. Wait, what? I thought you couldn't do it. it only, only whenever you plant it, whenever they're like seeds you could do it. I, I guess you could still do it. There you go, okay, cool. Well anyways, uh, the genie was going to be very busy next episode. And I have one, uh, one strawberry packet left over, so I guess we could have six in storage over there. So that'd be pretty cool. We have two lava eels now. No, we still only have one. And the water's red! Wait, what? How did- I didn't do it. And look at that, we got more, uh, whatever this is over here. 23 hours. Okay, so. We're going to get a bunch of jazz uh, honey over here, like from these and then these. Or no, no, no these are first. Yeah, because we, we replaced these last episode, I think. Yeah, cool. So this is what it's going to look like from now on whenever we get the uh, jazz honey or and any type of honey over here. And we don't have to risk like accidentally harvesting the blue jazz over there. So that's awesome. Cool. Definitely want to make more of these over here. So hopefully like like right now would be the perfect time to do it. So all the all the bee houses would be like synchronized with each other. Right. But I don't know why the the water over here changed red all of a sudden because it was blue and then now it's red. I thought someone said I could dye that myself, but I guess maybe it dies itself. I don't know. But anyways, I don't know how long this episode. I feel like it's going to be super, super a duper along. So I might as well end it off right here. We can start looking forward to next episode where I'm going to be continuing our Stardew Valley playthrough as a father. And then, yeah, wait, hold on. Yeah, it is every other day. So we just we just got a coffee earlier this episode. Then the second half of this episode, we didn't get any coffee. And then now we do. Yeah. So yeah, we're going to get a lot of heckin' coffee beans, guys. This is going to be amazing. And then, yep, all the other uh, kegs over here finished up as well. And the preserving jars, and these are going to finish up, I don't know when. 20, oh, 10 minutes. Oh my gosh, okay. So everything in here should be synchronized after uh, next episode. So anyways, speaking of next episode, let's look forward to next episode. That was a really bad transition there, but... <laughs> Until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. If you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to let me know by leaving a like down below. And if you guys want more of these awesome videos, be sure to hit that subscribe button. And while you're down there, be sure to ring that bell so YouTube sends you a notification as soon as the next episode of Stardew Valley comes out so you don't miss it. But until then, thank you guys all very much for watching. And I'll see you guys here next time with some more Stardew Valley. Oh, what in the world? What happened to my wave? Man, I uh, guess I'll do it this way. Oh, bye there.